Ladies and gentlemen, Justin Sred right here. Welcome back to the wonderful world of Skyrim. Last we left off, we did. I don't. I don't know what we did last time. I think we defended Right Run, which took like three tries, and we did a bunch of other stuff, and uh. Now we just have a lot of. Just a lot of crap to do. And uh. Oh, we can go kill a dragon. Why not? What a magnificent start to the day. Is Lydia still with us? Yes, she is. Of course she is. But, uh, we still have our, uh, our Imperial armor on. And that thing just crumbled to pieces. How much gold do I do? not have enough gold to buy a damn house. God damn it. I need somewhere to store my, uh, frickin', uh, second armor set whenever I'm not using it. City's quiet enough now. When the sun goes down, you best keep on your guard. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, let's get out of here so they can clean this mess up. And it seems like Gallows Rock is the quickest place we can go to. And hey, guess what? We move closer with our weapons drawn. Oh shit, Sherlock. Still here. Yep. Do I even have anything? Nah. Just a ton of Imperial armor. Nice log there. And NPCs can't jump off of ledges. Kind of annoying, not gonna lie. I'm like, why the hell can't they? What the? Yeah. Ow. I missed. No, I didn't. Hey, get back here. No. Stupid ambushes. Now oh, what the hell is attacking? What the hell else wants some of this? Elk, why are you attacking that? Lydia, it's just an elk. There, it's dead. <laughs> Damn, Lydia. Just attacking anything she sees. Oh, don't go down the freaking waterfall, please. Okay, just barely made it. <laughs> Yes, yes, I do hear the distant dragon. It's probably the dragon I'm gonna go kill. Oops. Wanna do that? There we go. Oh, something tells me this cave is infested with spiders. I don't know. It could be Draugr, but you never know. Hello. Oh, there's no giant spider on the ceiling, so... I'm just gonna chop my way through all these. Fancy fucking that, eh? Ow! Vampire! Vampire! I didn't contract vampirism from that, did I? No, no, I'm good. I'm actually resistant to disease. All oh, right, yeah, because I'm freaking beast blood. I forget. What <laughs> kind of bow do you even have? That's not a very fancy bow there. Maybe I can get you a better bow. What was that? Hey guys. 
No. Take that, spiked iron club. Lesser soldier. Gem. I have a coin purse. Bunch of ruined bucks. Good God. Hey, look, an arcane enchanter. <laughs> Frozen thunder. Imperial armor. I should probably wait until like I upgrade this or something before I go around enchanting it all. Come on, there we go. Fuzza. empty soul gems, right? Yes, I do. Oh, this stupid hip bone. Here, just fill that up. That's pretty cool. I also like the color effect of this thing. The color effect of this uh, Soul Trap spell is actually very cool. Next time I find anything better than this, I might just uh, disenchant this thing and enchant an owl with, uh, with what I got. Probably more spiders to be murdered over here, yep. Yo! Those two can just go suck a dick. What? I am taking names and capturing souls here. Good God. Taking names and capturing souls. There are chests at the bottom of this lake. There is. <sighs> Wonderful. Wait, I'm just deeper into the area I was already in? Oh, hello. Ow! Screw off, mate. Let me guess, there's a chest behind this? Yup. Hide braces of sure grip. I could probably enchant... Disenchant that. Something to use later. And I'm out of soul gems that are holy crap. Alright, I'm done with you for now. Don't want to waste the charge on it. Like a petty soul, though. Ow! Ha! Lydia! Let, let, Lydia! Kill the giant frostbite spider! Whew! 
Hey Lydia, how you doing? How's that orcish, uh, club thing holding out for ya? Dwarven Quarterstaff. Ring of Magicka. I might actually equip that just for the hell of it. Lydia, hello. Still here. I am sworn to I wonder if she'll burdens. use this. Oops. Damn it. Damn it. Oh yep, she uses it. I am sworn to carry your burdens. I guess she just uses the uh, weapon of highest value. I have so many steel arrows. Here, I'll take your steel arrow and you can have these. God dang it. Here, you can have those orcish arrows. Lead on. All right. After a bit of inventory management. Looks like we're done in Spider Cave. Ooh, land in the water. I just need to get out of here now. No, I need to get out of here. Now that we've purged some spoidas, it's time for us to get the hell out of this cave. Freaking hate spiders. I want to leave now. I'm dumb. This is not the way to go. You need to leave the way I came, and that's not climbing over rocks. That's for sure. Hey, look, a cave. What's inside? We just came out of said cave, Lydia. I don't know what you're smoking. Screech! 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 Let's kill us a dragon, shall we? I don't know where Lydia is, though. Oh, hello! Ow! Oh, there she is. I like how AI seem to just have an unlimited number of arrows. Yeah, I'm working on slaying the dragon. Ow! One of these days I'll get it. Oh, 
working on it. Oh shit. There we go. Ugh. Old bone scales arrow. Oh, that was fun. Fuzzle. Wait, I know you. What did I do? There's no mistake. You're a wanted woman, and it's time to pay for your crimes. Nah. Well, your bounty is low. All right, get out of my sight. But you're known to me now, scum. Remember wow. That? I like how he put his hands on his hip when he said that. And then he just casually strolls away. All right, motherfuckers. I heard the gourmet is hiding out somewhere in Skyrim. You know, fellow who wrote the cookbook. Excellent. You've done us a great service. Here is your reward. Yeah, don't mind me just casually killing a dragon. Thanks for the 500 gold. Alright, let's go find a helmet. Nice spear, dude. You have a mace. Can I just pay off the bounty? Wait, I know you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There is no mistake. You're a wanted woman, and it's time to pay for your Blah, blah, blah. Here's the fucking 40 gold. Good enough. I'll just confiscate any stolen goods you're carrying, then you're free to go. I... Here's the frickin' 40 gold note, get off my case, god damn. Let me guess. Some of your sweet rolls. Stupid guards and their stupid sweet rolls. That's a house. That's a house. That's the Skyrim. Yes? The Pit Fighters Training Hall, here it is. Welcome. To the Pit Fighters Training Hall, stranger. Home to what's left of the best arena team in Skyrim. Did you just come to Marcus, or are you really interested in throwing your life away, fighting in the pits? Talk to Sorolis. He owns the team. Wait a minute. This mod is custom voice acting. Pretty sure. Oh, I probably don't want to mess with you. Is it? I don't know who that is. You're not him. You're not him. Hmm? Huh? I'm just, you know. Who is this man you speak of that I need to talk to? You're not him. 
think he's up here. Who the hell am I talking to? Are you him? The pit fights aren't organized like the arena was. We travel just about anywhere that's willing to put on a fight. Most of the time, the fights in the cities are set up without the knowledge of the guards or authorities. Or with enough bribes to keep them quiet. Sometimes nobles with a taste for excitement will host private fights. And there are often contests in orc strongholds. On occasion, Sorolls has even been able to get us across the border to take part in fights in other provinces. Cool. We used to be a noble team. Many champions of the arena were trained in our ranks. Sorolls took me on after seeing me fight back in Sentinel. Most teams were disbanded when the arena shut down, but Garrick convinced Sorolls to set us up here and fight in the pits. Cool. I don't know who I'm looking for, though. Yes? Not long. My stall in the market was shut down after the war began, and the Stormcloaks found out my brother is in the Legion. So I started fighting for Sorolis to keep my family housed and fed. It was that or joined the war, and honestly, this seemed safer. <laughs> Fair enough. 